I love thoroughfare. My heart is here. You know, my family's here. I've, you know, I've always thought when I grew up that thoroughfare was the best place in the world to live. And to see that somebody wants to take and just kind of just take and just wipe all that away, it, it hurts to see that. We received a message that my aunt was going to be passing away, that the doctors hadn't given her much longer. And she wanted to be buried next to her husband who was buried in the potter's field. So I went down to get the grave prepared and initially it was fine. I was able to drive in and got some work started. I started having some cleanings on the cemetery. Um, maybe about two days in or so, I went to go in and there was a boulder blocking the, ro um, the road. W.M. Tender, who was claiming ownership of not only land adjacent to it, but uh, as well as the cemetery as well. And basically he was trying to say that we were trespassing and that he had the right at some point if he chose to, to take the graves out of the cemetery. So the only thing I can figure is that, that they did it out of spite. And when you hear about something like that, it makes you, it, first off, it's, it makes you angry and it makes you sad also too that somebody would go and do something like that. You know, the, the Scott Cemetery, they've already taken and bulldozed over top of graves that were there, you know, that we realized it could be anywhere between 75 to 100 graves in that particular site. Because they want to dig up these graves and build a damn brewery. What the hell is that all about? because you want to make beer, go somewhere else and make beer, but not over our, our ancestors' graves. 